Sports continuing coverage of the playoffs. I'm James Cebulski. Game five set to go between these two teams that have put on a fight so far. Two teams looking start for a win. And we are set to go. Don't you just love playoff hockey? Listen to this place. Let's get after it. A serving team. Quebec's got a hold of the puck. Now he takes it over the line. Here's a short pass to Snively. Up the club and makes the save. Atlanta's got a hold of it against the wall. Snively's been really impressive tonight, in particular on that last play, James. I mean, the wherewithal to keep your eye on the prize, eye on the puck, and just redirect the puck to the net. I mean, that's attack mentality, and he has it tonight. They go on the attack through center. Takes a shot. Big time stop. Picked up along the boards by Tynan. And another save. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We've still got zeros on the board. The Firebirds take possession off the faceoff. Here they come inside the neutral zone. Grabs control of it at the point. And the shot dies in the traffic jam. Quebec's got the puck in the defensive end. Sends it in on the attack. Atlanta's got a hold of the puck now. Quick pass over to Lindbergh. Quebec's got the puck in their own end. Through the open ice, they're picking up steam. Taken by Daou. Atlanta's got it across the line. anticipate the play. He does it perfectly and is able to negate the shot. Here he is in front! And that carries right off the mat! Tremendous intensity here in the offensive zone! And they'll end all that pressure as they clear the zone! Here's the pass! Cuts it on that big save! Goaltenders work so much on their reaction time, and man, this is just a clinic right now as he flashes the glove and makes the save. Still lots of time left in the period. Still scoreless in this one. Puck is dropped and he wins the draw here in the defensive zone. The Firebirds have it now. Quebec's looking to break out of their own end. Russell's across the line now and on the attack in the offensive end. Fires it! Oh, he just misses! What an opportunity there! Well, just is a big word, James, because when you have an opportunity like this on a primetime scoring area, you have to finish it off. He doesn't even hit the net. Quebec's got the puck along the wall. Edvinson's got it in the offensive zone. Makes the save. Takes the feed at center and moves forward. The Firebirds will play it in their own end. Down the right side and into the zone. Quick pass across to Spezia. Denies him with the pad. Handles the pass. Pumps the puck away. Loses his balance on the play. Gaining momentum in the offensive end. Quebec's got control of it now from the road end. Gaining momentum along the wing. Taken along the wall by Santini. Quick pass to Ness. Takes it into the slot. And that goes. Scores! And I think he put this in on his own. Well, he did, James. And this is so deflating when you put it in on your own. And you can just see the body language. He is not happy.
No deeks. Finally open the scoring here in the first. Now let's see how both teams respond, right, Cheryl? Yeah, and I think this is a product of just playing the game differently and having a different mindset. They started the game, they were hesitant, almost as if you're playing just to keep it close and not to lose. You got to play to win the game, and they've really opened it up in the latter half of this period. Back to the point it goes. Quick shot and makes the save. Moves it quickly over to Bassar. Another stop by the goaltender. And this is a dialed-in goaltender. Very aware, knows where the shooter is in that low spot and makes the save. More than half the period has gone by. Hope you're enjoying this one. one nothing is where we sit at this point. They take possession as he locks them up off the faceoff. Here's a chance to set up now. And he takes the feed. Gains control of the puck here at the line. And that carries off a body in the lane. Quick feed to Erickson. Good reach of the stick to knock the puck away. And he can't hang on after that hit. Tries to feed it over to Wagner. Excellent stick work on the play. Puts it on that. Stopped by the goaltender. Quebec's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Ness plays it now. Looking dangerous as they move along the boards. Puck dumped in deep, allowing for the defenseman to change. Along the right wall and into the offensive end. Centering feed. Misses the net. Takes a shot. Handles that one. Moves it to Russell. And now he moves it quickly to Maillet. Through the neutral zone, up along the wing. Swatted away with the stick in the defensive zone. The Firebirds move the puck in the defensive zone. Lugs the puck into the offensive zone corner. Covers it up and will get a stoppage in play. Atlantis down, but not out. They've had chances, they just haven't capitalized. Quebec's going to start with the puck in their own end. Here's a short pass to Maillet. Takes a shot. Turns it aside with the glove. In front and a stoppage on the play as the goaltender covers things up. Getting into the later stages of this period. 1-0 the score. And they win the offensive zone faceoff. Now let's see if they can capitalize. Great poke check on the reach. Scrum along the boards. Quebec's got possession of the puck. Way off target. Lindbergh's tripped up and the official's hand is in the air, signaling penalty. Here comes the sentence. The end of a period in a tight game and you take a penalty. Well, your PK unit, they've got to do a job and get you to the intermission. James through hard work and it's an opportunity to even the score here. They need to find a way to execute and get back to the even score. Scores! And they convert on the power play. Well, they drew the penalty because they were competing and they were urgent on the puck, James. And then the same approach came on the power play where they knew how to hound it and retrieve it. And guess what? They're rewarded for their efforts. This power play goal is a result of the face-off. I mean, winning possession right away, knowing exactly where that puck is going to go, reading the coverage perfectly for that goal. Centers glide into the dot as a face-off, ready to resume play. Atlantis got possession of the puck after that neutral zone face-off. Shot, and he comes up big with the stick save, getting all of it with the paddle. Strong use of the body to force the puck loose. Clock ticking down here inside the first period. Grabbed along the boards by Lindbergh. Fires it on net. Comes up with the stop. Goaltender hangs on for the whistle.
the Firebirds win that offensive zone faceoff. And that's blocked in traffic. Brings it into period number one. Still lots more action to go. Both teams will recharge and be back with more on ice action in the second in no time. comes right to him, puck on his stick. He lets it go for the tally. Quebec's rolling now, having taken a one-goal lead here in the second. Well, yeah, they got to be a wave of momentum that continues to push and press now, James, as they seem to have control of the game right now. They can't give any momentum back to their opponent. Hanks got it against the boards. What a steal in his own end. Just a little too much contact and couldn't hang on to the puck. And he made the save to keep that one out of the net. Ahead of steam now towards the front. And that's deflected off someone in front. Stick feed. Slides it diagonally to Walensky. Beats the goalie but can't beat the post. Quebec's been working hard and have put forth a strong effort throughout this entire game. And that's the reason they have the lead. They wanted to extend the cushion. But unfortunately, bad luck on their side or maybe it. It was good positioning by the goaltender, but nonetheless, it goes off the post and out. The Firebirds have been generating a lot of pucks on net, but they still trail here in the second. And with the centers tied up, he swoops in to take possession. Oh, he saved it! What a stop! Well, that's desperation at its finest to be able to get to that puck and sending a clear message to his team that he's behind him. He's going to be the foundation tonight. I really want to look at this last save again, James, because this is about taking it to the next level. When you have this level of competitiveness, athleticism, and desperation and urgency in your game, you know that goaltending coach, they can't just teach this. This is instinctual, and this is what winners are made of. Lots of time left in this period. Quebec's got a slim lead. They lead it 2-1. Here he is, shot the shot. There's the whistle. We'll get a face-off after the goalie covers up. Looks like lineups are set. They're ready to get things back underway. Eakins won the faceoff here in the offensive zone. Tenacious battle for the puck along the wall. Can't get a hold of that pass. And down he goes as the puck goes free. From the left side, he moves it up ahead. Quick shot. Here's a shot. And he stakes that one with the clock. This is a really nice save, James. I mean, the shooter's in the middle of the ice. He's in the slot area. And he's got to get to the top of the crease, square to the puck to be able to make that save. Great job. Quebec's won the draw. Quick pass to Akerson. Unable to reach that one. Mackey's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. Let's see what the official makes for the final decision. Well, when you're looking for the equalizer, it's tough to take a penalty and play shorthanded, James. you got to find a way to get to even strength so you can generate some offense. No deeps. Man advantage unit will take to the ice for the first time tonight. Well, they've earned their first power play of the game. A tone setter right here and an opportunity to look at the coverage on the setup. They clear the zone. 
Here's a shot. Oh, great save by Cormier. Puck battle along the boards. Quebec's got the puck. Into the offensive end now. Here's a great use of the stick right there to poke it away. Quebec's got the puck along the boards. This is a poor power play, James. You have to find your way to execute. You can't execute if you can't get in. And man, is the crowd ever frustrated. Drives to the paint. Oh, what a stop with the glove by Hober. What an incredible save in a high danger scoring area. I mean, right in the slot, he's in perfect position to make that glove save. More than half the period left to play. It's a 2-1 hockey game. Off the draw, he ties up his opponent. And he keeps possession. Picked up along the wall by Hag. Here they come on the attack down the left side. Puck picked up by Mackey. Quebec's looking to break out. Keep it out for the back of the net. That's a fantastic save by the goaltender, but his team has to do a better job of protecting the middle of the ice. Those high danger scoring chances eventually go in. Atlanta's been the busier team offensively with way more shots on goal, but they still trail in the second. From his own end, he picks up the puck. Can't hang on to the biscuit after that. And he slides it quickly to Broussard. And he takes the feed. Wagner's got the puck. Moves it to the middle. Oh, breaks the floor. Quebec's looking to break out. Atlanta's got a hold of it along the wall. And he takes the pass. Oh, what a save on the clapper. Oh, and another quick stop. Puck is frozen, and we get a stoppage in play. More than half the frame has been played here. It's 2-1. And they win the draw on their own end. Hard hit, frees up the puck. Good fight for the puck along the boards. Atlantis gained possession along the boards. Too much traffic in the lane. Scooped up along the wall by Foley. Here he is, wrists it on that. Fantastic save. Jorge has been outstanding, tracking pucks and making huge saves like that one right there. Great reach by Fogarty. Moves it quickly over to Doe. Carries the puck through the neutral zone. With possession along the wall. And he was ready for that save. Picked up along the boards by McKenzie. Puck scooped up by Rosen. Penalty coming up as the play is blown dead. Well, everyone has a job and a role to do, and guess what? It's about PK execution right now. They have the one goal lead. Now they're protecting it. Well, with earlier success on the power play, I think they'll operate in the same fashion, James, in that 1-3-1 setup where they look to work through the flanks because you know they've got some lethal shooters on this team. They'll want to clear the zone here while they're trying to kill off this penalty. Puck move back to center, forcing them to regroup. From the left side into the middle of the neutral zone. Picks up the puck. Here's a chance. Oh, he gets a blocker on him. What a stop by Cormier. Puck clears the zone. Now he takes it over the line. Oh, excellent use of the stick as he knocks that one away. Gets it out of his own end. McKenzie's penalty is almost expired. And the power play comes up empty. Both teams back to even strength. Well, often in hockey, we say timing is everything. And when you're down by a goal and you have an opportunity on the power play, you have to cash in. And the whole bench knows that that was a missed opportunity. Shot denied by the goaltender. Goaltender covers up and will get a face off. Atlanta's got to find ways to finish because they continue to trail here late in the second. And momentum on their side as they win the draw here inside the offensive zone. 
Grabs possession of the puck. Tynan's running and gunning tonight, James. He got the go-ahead goal earlier, and now he's looking for more. Quick feed to Olivier. Right in the slot, and it goes just wide. Well, it goes wide, but the puck is finding him, James. He's getting to the right place at the right time. If he continues these habits, one is going to convert. Let's it go! And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Cormier's been so consistent throughout tonight's game, and, I mean, he's made timely saves as well. A lot of shots that he's faced, and his save percentage is an indicator of it. The Firebirds scoop it up along the boards. Atlanta's got the puck against the half wall. Nothing! Quebec's got the puck. Barber's stick handling in his own zone. Fans want a shot here in the dying seconds of the period. Gets it over to Severin. 40 minutes down, still another 20 to go here in this one. Join us for period number three next. so far. Atlanta's put in a strong effort tonight, James, and there's 20 minutes left, so there is some runway to claw their way back into this game, especially when they've dominated possession time. Now, this can be frustrating at times when you feel like you're holding the puck and you're going nowhere, but at the end of the day, it's all about cashing in right now and what you can do in these last few shifts to make a difference. Handles the puck at the point. of the game, James, to even it up. This is huge for this power play. Your big stars, they need to shine. The Firebirds have it now. Moves the puck. Into the offensive zone. Here's a shot, and he comes up with it. Here he is from the slot. Too much congestion in front. To the low slot. Atlanta's power play fails to ignite. They're still trailing by one. Well, it's a tough one when it's a tight game and you get a call, but the PK cut unit comes out here and they deliver, James, and you have to have the ability to embrace the pressure, and they did just that. Takes a shot. Oh, big time save by Cormier. Look out. Scores. And they tuck it into the back of the net. on there, James. I think they waved this off immediately. This goal is not going to count. They've got to be mindful to stay calm. I know the call went against them, but we're about to drop the puck here again. Lindbergh's gained possession inside the neutral zone. Quebec's got to hold of it against the wall. Santini stick handling in his own zone. Down the left wing, across into the offensive end. Puts it on there. Stopped by the goaltender. Moves it to Fogarty. Great defensive effort with the stick. Stop that one. Scrum along the wall. Trying to get back on the attack now. Take it along the wall by Daoud. 
Shot in front. Cormier's got it and will hang on for the whistle. Well, he's been so dialed in all game, playing confident and controlled in the crease. Atlanta's Achilles heel tonight has been finding offense as they trail here in the third. Lindbergh's won the faceoff, and now let's see what they can do. Scoops up the puck. Reaches out and uses the stick. Fires one on the Scores! And the scratching and clawing has paid off as we are back to even. Well, we're back to evens, James. I really like their game. I mean, when you're pushing and you're trying to find a way to get ahead and on top, you have to trust the process. That's exactly what they've done, and they've been rewarded for it. Atlanta's effort in the offensive zone has resulted in the equalizer. And look at this, Cheryl. Tie game, third period. Let's dig it. Let's dig it. Let's go, if that's what you mean. But this is fantastic. Anytime two teams, good teams at that meet, you know that it's going to go back and forth. But really believe that the momentum has shifted here. The urgency that they've led the third period with, it's been outstanding. Right up the cut into the offensive end. And that's blocked from someone in front. Handles it along the blue line. Off target. Grabbed along the board by Daru. Oh, here we go. This team knows how to turn it up another gear, and they have done that here. Penalty coming up, and we're going to get a stoppage in play. within a game, James. It's tight. The game really hasn't opened up. you got to play free, but you have to play responsible as well. The Firebirds have it against the wall. Puck gets loose. We'll get some flow again here. Cutting to the slot. Denies him with the pad. It's amazing to me how he always looks like he's in the right position because he tracks and reads the play so well, and this time he gets in front of the puck that's right in the middle of the ice as the shooter's got a dangerous opportunity. Into the corner now. Routine glove stop by Hooper. Ref blows the whistle as the puck's covered up. Late goings of this period. We got a tie game. Atlanta's got the puck after winning the defensive zone faceoff. 
Moves the puck across to Dao. Moves it around along the half wall. Big play inside the defensive zone. Mackey's taking it from his own end. And now it's grabbed by Snively. Skates to the crease. Oh, he got all of that. What a save by Hover. I love this save, James. I mean, the goaltender is so aggressive on this play. Doesn't give the shooter any time to get rid of it. Oh, a clutch save. Higginson's got it in the defensive end. Oh, smart heads up play to put that one away. Sends the pass over. Atlanta's got the puck along the wall. And that one's stopped. Quebec's got possession of the puck. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. The Firebirds have it from their own end. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Takes a shot. Shoot it into your own net, trying to clear the puck. That's ugly. The Firebirds are looking to close things out. They have been dominant all night long, and they continue to lead late in the third. There's the horn, and that's the hockey game. A series that's been back and forth and a win tonight gives them that 3-2 advantage in the series. I don't think this is over yet, though, Cheryl. Uh, it's not over because it's been a slog up this entire time. It's been back and forth action. One gets an inch, the other one takes it. And so now they have a 3-2 series lead, so it's do or die for their opponent. But for them, it's about finding a way to have the killer instinct and close it out the next game. Thanks so much for joining us for this postseason action, and we will see you at the next playoff game. See you, everybody.